Hi everyone, this is RJ at Single Dad, and my Single Dad Diary today is about backyard drive-in. So, spring break is here, and there's a lot of people out there that are wanting to know what do we do with these kids during spring break, because all your kids want to do is play, 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 and for some of us out there, we're on a very tight budget, and we need to find economical ways to have fun with our kids without spending a lot of money. So, I want to share one of my ideas with you on what I did this past weekend in making a time true tradition of drive-ins, which I don't know if you remember growing up, drive-ins. Drive-ins are a little bit of nostalgia in my household because growing up, I remember going to the drive-in and it was a great experience. And there is one near my town and we go out as much as we can to go see them. But what I designed this last weekend was to create the drive-in atmosphere and bring it to my home. So what I did is I went and grabbed my laptop, got a projector and some external speakers for my, uh, for my laptop and created a movie or posted a movie onto the back side of my garage door and we were watching a big screen movie in fact, this uh, episode was Twister that you're about to see. And what we did is we had our outdoor fire pit and between the fire pit and the outdoor movie and lots of blankets and lots of friends and lots of neighbors over, we created a memory. We created a great trip in the backyard. So we didn't have to go to the drive-in. We're able to enjoy a movie all together as a family and have friends and family and relatives over and enjoy the whole full screen effects of a drive-in in the backyard. So take a look at this and you'll see what I used. I'll kind of give you some pictures of what the, uh, how simple it was to make and uh, backyard drive it. <laughs> 